Liz's cocktails. Scene 19, take one. Wait, Liz, Liz, come here. Happy Friday, everybody. What is up? Welcome to Liz Does Cocktails. I'm Liz. And today we are going to be making a green apple ginger martini. It's delish. You're only going to need one green apple, some apple slices for garnish, ginger infused vodka, which I'm gonna tell you how to make, this apple lime mixture, which I'm gonna tell you how to make as well, and honey with water. Super easy, just mix equal parts water and honey and you stir it up till it's dissolved. To make the ginger infused vodka, you're gonna want to grate ginger. I used to use like a cheese grater and I just grated some ginger into vodka. Let it sit for at least two hours, maybe like every 30 minutes or every 50 minutes put on a timer or something and just like shake that bad boy up to get all that like ginger and vodka essence all mixed in I let mine sit for two days so it's like pretty gingery now to make the lime apple green juice for the green apple lime juice get one large tart green apple some water and the lime juice put all of that into a blender. I used a food processor from my ninja, which I'm obsessed with. It can do everything in your kitchen. Blend it until it's just as blended as possible. Strain that mixture until you get just the juice, which is this. After you've prepped all of your ingredients, you're gonna wanna get a shaker and fill it with ice. Add your apple lime juice mixture, your honey and water, and depending on how sweet you want it is how much honey and water you're gonna put in there. And then you're gonna take your ginger infused vodka. What does it smell like? It smells so good. If you love ginger anything like me, I'm a huge fan of ginger turmeric, it's my absolute favorite. But if you love ginger anything, so good. Ginger vodka's in there. I'm gonna close up your shaker and shake it up. And strain it into a martini glass. Garnish with a little, little apple slice. I almost forgot what this was. And you're done. Green apple ginger martini. So, I'm allergic to apples. <laughs> also, I have a lot of food allergies. It's really annoying. But I did take a tiny sip and it is so delicious. I highly recommend you guys try it. If you guys do and you're able to actually drink the whole thing, unlike me, let me know in the comments below. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe. Hit that thumbs up button and the notification bell and I will see you guys next Friday. Bye.